reduced politicization, improved meritocracy, improved competence, better management. However, in the current situation, I think it's going to be simply necessity that drives these reforms. You've seen the inner workings of government because you've been a consultant to a uh, finance minister and a foreign minister. Uh, do you feel from what you've seen that we have the capability within the bureaucracy and the political leadership to do this? And, and, and having seen the insights, what do you suggest our approach be? So I think ideally we would have done many of these reforms as was the case in the 95 to 2004 period roughly, where there was... Uh, effort put to improve governance um, and reduce politicization, improve the quality of management, and essentially what, what can broadly be described as governance reform, reduce politicization, improved meritocracy, improved competence, better management. However, in the current situation, I think it's going to be simply necessity that drives these reforms. And there's going to be two types of necessity. First is in order for the government to hit its fiscal targets, because of the dire situation it's in, um, it's going to de facto, I imagine, impose hard budget constraints. And that will force the quality of management to improve. So instead of having better boards, better governance and so on and so forth, rather what was impossible before has become possible now. The second um, area is that Again, necessity is going to drive privatizations. So already there is a debate on whether domestic debt needs to be restructured. I personally cannot see how we will achieve debt sustainability without some level of restructuring of domestic debt. That will naturally affect the banking sector and may re result in the necessity for recapitalization. How the government of Sri Lanka is going to recapitalize the banking sector, I can't see that happening without a significant divesture of assets. And so that will automatically result in a process of privatization and improved uh, governance and competence in, in, in that sector. Mm -hmm.